What's going on, y'all? Wolf, back at you again with another reaction. All right, Chad, before we move on to this Bleach episode, I am at least five episodes ahead on the Patreon with the full reactions available, of course. So if you want to watch those instead, make sure you look at the links down below in the description. You know what I'm saying? Uh, also, check out my live stream. Uh, it, they will be at 6 p.m. PST almost every day. I mean, as long as I have a game to play, it should, it should be every day. Uh, and over there, I'm just playing games and having fun and chilling with y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's a nice vibe. It's chill, we're chilling out. We're hanging out. So... Go check that out if you're interested. For more content for, from Wolf, <laughs> right? Um, also, uh, go ahead and follow me at, uh, on my Twitter, at Wolf Reacts. Um, sometimes I got some random shit to say. Also, it's a nice way for me to... Another way for me to build a community, you know what I'm saying? So, go do that. I um, mean, what else I got? I should write all the stuff I have down so I don't have to fucking always think of it off rip, off the top of the dome. But, uh, yeah. Okay, that should be it. Anyway, so last episode of Bleach... Um, what happened last episode of Bleach? Well, I believe Nozomi found, uh, I guess, random Senkaimons are spawned, according to her, throughout the world, I guess. And these Senkaimons are linked to the Precipice world. Uh, and, I mean, there are some that, you know, will take her to uh, nowhere. There are some that'll take her to somewhere. <laughs> right? These are all just random portals that she doesn't know where she's gonna end up. But what she do what but what she, what she does know is if she goes inside one of these random Senkaimons, that she will never be found, and Kageroza Inaba will never be able to, I guess, achieve his true form or his true power. Um, so there is some, you know, there is some sense to what she is saying. But uh, for the sake of the anime story, we cannot let her do that. Not only is she a pretty cool character and honestly fits the kind of dynamic, dynamic of the group so well, um, you know, Ichigo's not gonna let her do that. You know what I'm saying? We have the ability, we have the capabilities to protect her. And especially after Ichigo just saved her now, he, uh, Getsuka Tenshou, five, you know, almost lieutenant level people pretty much, which was a little bit strange as far as power levels go, but, you know, it's all good. Uh, he did save her, so hopefully she has changed her mind. And I believe we also saw her smile for the first time. So maybe she's finally, finally, you know, will cooperate with us. And yeah, we can finally take down Kageroza. Um, in Soul Society, we have Yamamoto against the Regai versions of Kiraku and Ukitake, which is uh, kind of a throwback to the Soul Society arc when they actually went up against each other. Uh, and, and unfortunately, we didn't, we didn't see um, what happened during the fight, but we saw the aftermath. And... Um, I mean, these are some of like the oldest members of Soul, of Soul Society, right? So, as much as I want to see the fight, we're probably not. I mean, it would, honestly, it would be better for them to save it for the for the Thousand Year Blood War arc if we ever get to see that. You know what I'm saying? If we ever get to see a Kiraku and Ukitake fight, and of course, according to your comments, uh, we do. So, um, anyway, that's pretty much it. Did anything else happen? I don't believe so. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, we are continuing the reggae filler arc of Bleach, episode 24. 24. Make sure you like, subscribe. Let's go, bro. So, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to Okay, 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 okay. What the hell is Kenpachi doing here? <laughs> Hopefully this isn't Ray Guy Kenpachi. That would be bad. Oh shit. Oh shit. I mean, can can Kokujo stop it? He's a big dude. He can. Oh no, nope. he got swallowed up instantly. <laughs> Sheesh, man. Well, Kamomura's down. Hello. 
何がさやまじいお主らがまるで本物のように口を聞き本物のように振る舞い本物のように戦う Yeah, they're really well made <laughs> Kage Kagero's is kind of a beast お主らのものではなかろうてならば見せてみろその誇りとやらおいTakaoni, Kagayoni, so confusing to fight against. Oh shit. So, this is the only 1v1 that I'm okay with happening. You know, Kenpachi versus Kenpachi. <laughs> That's the one thing I actually want to see. Because it's not going to be boring. They're both just going to do hella damage to each other, right? How about uh, Yachidu versus Yachidu? Or did they not make a regular copy of her? Holy <laughs> shit. He likes that though. <laughs> Oh, what? Deflected. Jeez. Oh. Oh! Kenpachi? Can the Ray guy like overload on themselves? It seems like their eyes are going crazy. And the more they fight. You know what? I don't mind at all if he gets a Yechidu power up right now. Because they are they are the dynamic duo in the show. So I don't mind at all if he gets a Yechidu power up. <laughs> this is fine with me. Oh shit, Kendo style. Wait, double ke Kenpachi Kendo swings? This is gonna break the earth. <laughs> That's the Ray guy. <laughs> GG. Nicely done, Kenpachi. That was sick. <laughs> Got to see Kenpachi's kendo style again. Nice. <laughs> Dude, I like their duo so much, man. They're so awesome together. I just, I'm just waiting for the day that we see Yachito actually fight. <laughs> for now, she's just a cheerleader and makes you know Kenpachi stronger. I really want to see her fight, though. Oh no! Isana, you're a Ray guy the whole time? Oh, is that the. We've seen that bracelet before. Rangiku was wearing it. Oh wow! Damn, that's kind of insane. And the Precipice world must have st stocked up a lot of Reishi throughout the years, you know what I'm saying? Oh, damn. I mean, we legit haven't seen Unohana fight yet. So if we see it in this filler arc against herself, I'd be very, very confused. <laughs> Because why would they show Uno how to fight in the filler arc and not the canon? Because, I mean, she's one of the most anticipated characters that I want to see fight uh, of all. You know what I'm saying? But hey, if it happens, it happens. I, I will not complain. Right? Okay. So that was cool. Kenpachi versus Kenpachi. Nice. That was a good fight. Animation. Uh, the animation in this arc is very, very good. It's very good. It's pretty much on par with the Fullbringer arc. Um, you know what I'm saying? 
uh, I, I, also the animation in the movies are very good too. Um, also, um, I keep saying also, yuck. If, if you guys don't know, I am watching Memories of Nobody um, when I'm done with the Reg Regai filler arc. So you guys can look forward to that. You know what I'm saying? Cool, cool. Uh, but it looks like Kage Rosa, everything is going according to his plan. We are winning our fights though. We are winning our Regai fights and slowly, you know, defeating one, one Regai after another. So eventually we're, uh, we just have to keep winning. But it's really all about who defeats Kageroza, and normally that would be the protagonist, Ichigo. Uh, but he is getting weaker. Also, Kageroza kind of kicked his ass while he was in Vizard form, so I don't see that happening. <laughs> Maybe we just gotta team up against them, right? Um, but we still don't, honestly, we still don't know the extent of Kageroza's powers. Uh, we do know his plan is pretty goddamn good. He's been he's been collecting Reishi the whole time, and he has used them to make his army, and his army seems pretty goddamn strong, because, I mean, they are stronger versions of the originals, right? So, um... Anyway, I love the duo of Kenpachi and Yachiru. Um, Gon and Killua is still the best duo in anime, but honestly, Kenpachi and Yachiru is right there with them in second place, or you know, just right there. They definitely are in the top five list. Their dynamic is so, it's hilarious. You got this Kenpachi guy who will kill you if you look at him wrong, honestly, and Yachiru, this adorable fucking pink haired girl that motivates him to get stronger. Imagine. You know what I'm saying? He got he won that fight because of Yachiru. He didn't want to lose in front of her. You know what I'm saying? He wanted to Mamoru protect her, right? Very wholesome. He will he will never admit it, but that's uh, their their relationship is very wholesome. I love it. So anyway, uh, I'm looking forward to watching the next episode. I'm looking forward to see how this uh, filler arc rounds out. You know, um, and how they're gonna uh, make how how are they gonna make Ichigo getting weaker compelling? You know. Because, um, I mean, it's compelling already in that sense, but if he's getting weaker, then what the fuck? He's the one that's supposed to fight the final boss, right? So, very interested to see what, what they do there. Uh, and yeah, but of course, uh, if you guys are watching this on the YouTube, I am at least five episodes ahead on the Patreon with the full reactions available, of course. So if you want to watch those instead, make sure you look at the links down below in the description. Uh, also, tune into my live streams, 6 p.m. PST. Um, I play games. I chill out with y'all. More content from you guy, Wolf. And uh, yeah, we're just hanging out, having a good time. Uh, follow my Twitter, at WolfReacts. You know what I mean? Um, I feel like I'm missing something, but fuck it. Anyway, uh, make, sure you like, subscribe, make, make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. Um, and uh, yeah, I will see y'all next reaction. Uh, y'all have a good one. Okay, okay. Peace out, bro.